How can you believe, meaning you can't, when you receive glory from one another and do not seek the glory that comes from the only God? You can't believe. Why? Because you love the glory of man, not the glory of God. You love it. It feels so good to be praised, complimented, approved, applauded. It just feels so good. You don't want Jesus because you want praise from man. You want to be the center. You want to be in control. You want to be exalted. You want to be made much of. You want to be somebody. Pick whichever of those seems to fit you best. For me, they all fit perfectly. That's who I am by nature. I, I reverence the fall of man in its power over me. I was born this way. I was spitting out parent controlling commands from the day I was three days old. And I've never changed in my root humanity until God moved and killed the old man and brought a new creature to life who, who hates this and wars on it day after day, which is the only reason I have any perseverance in faith at all is because God keeps showing up to help me keep putting that old man to death every day. I don't need to remember 50 years ago what this was like. I just need to remember an hour ago or maybe five seconds ago, hoping you're going to like this sermon. And who cares, right? Except that you be saved. It is so subtle. So, verse 43 seems to me pretty clear. You cannot believe if you have a love affair unchecked by the Holy Spirit with the praise of man, with human glory, and no love affair with the glory of God. 